Rockford's number one hit music station, 97 ZOK. I'm Sweet Lenny. Some afternoon sleaze with Midday. Michelle, hello. Hello. So, I don't remember how long ago, if it was like six, six weeks ago, a couple months. Oh, okay. So, it was in March when the story about Tiffany Haddish and Beyonce yes. got leaked or something. Tiffany said that someone bit Beyonce. Which is hilarious. Okay. And not just like bitter. I mean, I don't know. When I hear like somebody bit somebody, I usually think like their arm, right? Yeah, you know, like teeth marks. Like yeah. I don't expect like broken skin. Well, this person that's gross. bit her face. Oh, that's a weird thing. Yeah, like who bit Beyonce's face? Here, like if you bite my hand, I guess that's not as bad. But this person bit Beyonce's face, and for it was like every day, right? Somebody else was like, "I know who bit Beyonce." Chrissy Teigen was one of the people who came out and said, "I know who it is. I know who it is. I know who it is." Who? Who? And now we all know who it is. Okay. Except, have you ever heard of this person before? Ready? Sana, Sana, laughing. Yes. What? She is an actress, isn't yes, she? Yes, she is. Keep going, Wikipedia. Do you know what she was in? Um, no. She was in The Best Man, The Best Man Holiday, Love and Basketball, Brown Sugar, Alien vs. Predator, The Family That Prays. I can't pronounce that word. <laughs> now huh. you see me too. She has a Tony Award. She's she has done yeah, a lot of she, things. Yeah, she she's a she's a, a relatively famous actress. She's the one who bit Beyonce's face. She is the one that bit Beyonce. And apparently, Tiffany Haddish is like good friends with. I'm sorry, is it Senna? Senna, yeah. Senna Lathan. Uh, with her parents, and uh -huh. so like they were super mad at Tiffany, and she was like, "I never said who it was." And then someone else must have revealed, and now today it's like. It's I want to say that she was Sana was bigger, probably like in the mid two thousands, late nineties, when she had like a bigger run when it um, came to movies and stuff. She was, was she like, the it, mother of Wesley Snipes in Blade in nineteen ninety eight. Ah, uh, oh, yes. She okay. Also some stuff with Eddie Murphy. So, yeah, you're probably right. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, now where can you see more? You can read more on Twitter at 97 Okay. Congrats for knowing who that person is. I told you I, I did didn't before know. we started this. <laughs> Ariana Grande and Florida next on 97 Z. Okay. That was a twist of events. I see. So like, now, oh, that's a real great. I can kind of picture her. I'm oh. so good at setting up the camera just to. Put my arm fat on display. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't know her. She's 46. Yeah. She's in, I mean, she's a Tyler Perry actress. She's got, a, she got her on Twitter. So that's who it was. According to the story, like, I mean, I don't know if you're, obviously, you don't remember all the beginning stuff. Like, Beyonce was, like, talking about how this girl was on drugs at this party or whatever. Like she didn't, not that that's like a good excuse, but like Beyonce was like, no, like that girl's not drunk. She's like on something. Like that's not normal. She, she shaved her head. After she did Beyonce? She felt so bad about it. No. Well, Beyonce's a musical icon. I wonder what would drive her to, to she bite. She said she was on drugs. No, she her head's not shaved anymore, but it is growing. I mean, she did shave. It's growing back. <laughs> wow, that's something. All right, well, I'm, I'm so excited that you were pleasantly interested in that story. Well, I, I, I told you that I would know. When we started, you were all... It's because people are going to care about Shawn Mendes' cover of if you his like own you song. If you Shawn Mendes' cover of his own song, maybe we'll talk about that tomorrow. <laughs> Unless something else comes up. All right.